Like the king, the queen, and the jack. The so numbers 11, 12, 13. I wonder if that coincides. No. Uh, I'm gonna let you first. And assume that's king, this is queen, maybe this is jack. Nope, apparently that wasn't it. So apparently, we just get to mess around with this and hopefully we get the right... Oh, there we go. Only took two tries. Out pops the gear. Out comes the shotgun, because I don't know if anything busts in the room. Mm. I don't know. But we have the... Yeah, I know the wheel's missing. I saw it fall out. If we pick up the gear, Leon, jeez. The cog piece, or the cog... What's it called? Cog wheel? The cog wheel. The cog wheel. I call it a gear. That's what I'm going to call it. So that was pretty much it for that room. Now I probably should go save the game. It's we got a, we got quite a bit done. And if I do die, which uh, pro tip, I'm pretty sure you can get killed by one hit, killed in one hit by some stuff, such as liquors. I believe they do have the ability to decapitate you in one shot. Much like the uh, hunters do in Resident Evil 1, they can kill you in one shot. And pretty much like I stated, this isn't any sort of pro run. Not trying to get an A on this. In fact, I was more or less shooting for at least a C. But it doesn't matter. Where do we have to go? We have to go to the gear room. We can ditch this. We can bring out that. Alright. I need to go save on the one typewriter. Come back. Put the stupid... It's busy work, pretty much. I'm just going to save on this typewriter. So now we, get, we have the cog wheel, which will open up a little door... Uh, nearby. I like where we're at. We'll open up a little door nearby. There's something in it. I think it's the last chest piece. And then... Is that the last chest piece or like C4 or something? I don't know. I'm carrying the ink ribbon on me. Doesn't matter. Oh, hey! Check it out. There's a liquor here. I wonder if switching to the pistol would be... Would save ammo. Wow, it's... Yeah, see? Liquors are starting to spawn here. Okay, I guess two shotgun shots. And... I know there's, like, more liquors around here somewhere. Pieces of shit. Yeah, I know. I know there's more. That's what I was talking about earlier. Good to know that two shotgun shots and one pistol bullet will basically kill a liquor. Oh, someone's angry. And now there's a bunch of zombies busting in. Because I didn't put any stupid... <sighs> I didn't put any of the cabling up. Which is what I was talking about earlier, so whatever. Missed opportunity with that. I don't even know if we need to go back through that area. I honestly don't remember. I'm pretty sure there's at least one more liquor out here. On this little random catwalk of nothingness. Is there? Nope. Could have swore there was one up here. Oh well. I better have that damn cog on me. That stupid ass gear better still be in my inventory. I better not have put it anywhere. Like a dumb. Alright. Go up yonder staircase. No Juliet here. Put the stupid gear. I don't need this right now. Great. So am I standing in the wrong spot? The gears are clean. Maybe I'm supposed to be standing like right here. There we go. Finicky thing. It looks like a switch. Will you push it? Yes. And thus it spins. Little door opens up. 
I guess we have to jump down it. Never mind. Is there not? Ah, yeah, there we go. An old dust chute where you jump down. Yes. Pretty sure it just leads us back into the basement. We might get a little cutscene here. Yeah, it does lead us right back into the stupid fucking basement. Yeah, it looks like it was real safe in there. Looks real safe in that uh, cell now there, you dumbass. Where are we at? What's this way? Hmm, I don't know what that way is. Alright, what's this way? Right, this is the kennel and shit. So now we gotta go check up on stupid ass. <sighs> I think little monsters pop out of them. Up oh, there he is. Can you still hear me? Come on, answer. Damn. I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co conspirator. Oh, get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Oh, it's not looking too good. It's burning. What's wrong? Nicely done, Ben. Nicely done. God, what was that? It was Ben's chest monster. Mail to the chief. To that guy. We have lost the mansion lab facility due to the actions of the renegade operative Albert Wesker. Hmm. Fortunately, his interference will have no lasting effects upon our continued virus research. Our only present concern is the presence of the remaining STARS members. Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers, and Bickers. If it comes to light that the STARS have any evidence... Uh, as to the activities of our research, must dispose of them in such a manner that would appear to be purely accidental. Well, Vickers gets killed. Um, Chris and Jill are still doing their thing. I don't know what the hell happened to Rebecca, and I think Burton's still kicking around somewhere. Continue to monitor their, their progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. Annette will continue to be your contact through this affair. William Birkin, whatever. I've deposited the amount of 10 grand U.S. to the account for your services this term as per our agreement. The development of the G-Virus scheduled to replace the T-Virus is nearly completion. Once completed, I am certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the executive board for Umbrella Incorporated. It is imperative that we proceed with extreme caution. Redfield and the remaining STARS members are still attempting to uncover information on the project, continue to monitor their activities, and block all attempts to investigate... Uh, the underground research facilities. Man, how much mail did the... We have a problem. I have received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G-Virus. There are an unknown number of agents involved. They must not be allowed to take the project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the city thoroughly for any suspicious persons. Detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed necessary. And contact me immediately through a net. With these precautions, any possible threat should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus. Not even Umbrella. Oh, they steal it. Trust me. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada, wait! Hey! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. She's trying. A miserable death. What's back here? 
Is there nothing back here? It's in his cell. Nothing in his cell? Hmm. It's kind of poopy. Didn't I leave a green herb in here? Come on, get in there. Didn't I? Yes, I did. Alright, well, we can take this real quick. Use that. We're fine. Let's see. And now, uh, we have to... Tra-la-la, we have to go and, uh, get through that door with the chess pieces, because we have all four of them now. Which I think is... Oh, wait a minute, hold on. I think it's this way, isn't it? Isn't it through the sewers and... No. It's not, it's not through... It's not through that, is it? Where the hell is it? I don't know, we're gonna figure this out. I don't think that goes to where I want. Now there's probably dogs in this dumbass parking lot. Or the parking garage, or the underground parking facility, whatever. Oh, there's no dog in here. Well, what the hell? 